What is comedy? What is offensive? Listening to some Bill, Bill Burr. To a Bill Burr podcast. And he was mentioning how uh, Jerry Seinfeld and uh, Jay Leno had uh, kept their ad kept their comedy acts clean. And how Jay Leno was um, had always kept it clean because he had uh, was getting ready to do the Tonight Show from years on back. He was preparing for that uh, sort of audience, and uh, that that made me think. I really. I wonder, like, uh, I also want to make another video called, you know, how much does it cost to corrupt you? Because, let's say this uh, drawing channel was picked up, or had uh, picked up millions of subscribers, or um, Nickelodeon wanted to show to, um, for me to draw on, but I had to uh, jump through their hoops and tone down the language. And uh, I would have to say no because uh, even if they offered some silly money, because I wouldn't know how to be uh, some 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 other way. Even when I've had um, been in other jobs where I had to deal with um, being professional, uh, politically correct. Uh, I couldn't um, become the. I couldn't maximize my effectiveness, my customer service. And eventually, more of my clients they would um, just, you know, chill out, take a deep breath, and fucking be yourself. And uh, it was it was a trip working for some some people. But I think so. So many people want you know the. They feel that it, life is like the Jetsons, I guess. You know, we've already reached our optimum, optimum um, technology, and uh, we should just live it up now. No need to make conflict anywhere. You know, terrorism gun crime, street violence, that's all just, uh, it's really, really rare. You know, would I be a good person or a bad person if I just said, you know what, fuck all these uh, fucking junkies, fuck all these uh, poor schmucks who uh, can't afford to get art lessons, can't afford to get um, into a good high school who can't find mentors uh, to coach them, to teach them. You know what? Uh, let me just do my own thing, party on up, and uh, keep all this knowledge or insight or experience to myself. Yeah, fuck them. Would that make me a good person or a bad person? Or a selfish person? And also, um, I don't believe uh, selfishness is necessarily a bad thing because I believe that I am selfish by um, focusing on, on my goals now. Because I've worked with the other, other companies, other businesses, and helped them to grow it. And now I feel that you know, it's time for me to do my own thing. I've lost my train of thought here because we go in on many different directions here from here. I couldn't do a fucking uh, rated PG-13 or a PG fucking drawing channel. I couldn't do that. I can't, uh, 
I'm tired of being like some of these uh, motherfuckers that just uh, well, they pretend there's no problems in the world. Keep on drawing because I know that uh, I have a lot of competition out there. Not just from uh, other graphic artists, illustrators, com comic book artists, tattoo artists, but from, um, you know, people can choose to spend their money on other things or on other subjects, what? Comedy, music, music almond, buying a music album. Find clothes, uh, going to the movies. And it's up to me to create something that uh, says, you know what, instead of spending money here or on this, or on myself or on somebody else, I'm going to spend it on an art print. And for that, I need to sit down and draw. Keep my uh, shit uh, nice and tight. I'll pay attention to detail. I'm not the only uh, game in town. And also, once I get someone's attention, how can I uh, close the sale? Right now I'm actually drinking because um, I was yawning. <clears throat> yawning. I should get, if I should get more coffee or, or an energy drink or eat some fruit. But overall, just to just get shit done. What is, uh, what is humor, what is comedy, and what's offensive? And a website that I, that I keep on recommending is also LiveLeak. If you think your fucking world, your universe is all perfect, and I'm being paranoid and bad shit uh, rarely happens. Just check out that channel, check out that website. See how much uh, callous shit, evil shit, fucking or stupid shit, reckless shit the uh, mankind does.
for a while my um, focus was on uh, making anti-Muslim artwork. I'm not a fan of any religion. You can practice whatever you'd like. But the moment that uh, it starts to create suicide bombers or hurting other people in other ways, I think um, the belief system should be criticized. I remember getting all these death threats when uh, people were getting blasted that uh, Charlie Hebdo magazine, I think a satire magazine, because he had drawn they had drawn the Prophet Muhammad. And it's amazing that even the uh, days after that I'm blowing those days after that uh, many people were I had seen some commentaries like well you shouldn't be critiquing other people's gods Um, let's say I believe then the, the Greek gods, uh, so mess up, I'm trying to mess up their names, let's see, Zeus, Apollo, Neptune, or was that Roman? But Nike, Hercules, let's say that all these characters were part of my um, daily routine of, of worship. And uh, one of you guys drew a, uh, a cartoon of Zeus shooting lightning bolts. So on top of a uh, cheeseburger as he's um, protecting the shoppers of Walmart. And I, um, and I found out who drew it and I fucking behead them. And I say that it's the name of um, the almighty Zeus that I did that for. How dare they uh, criticize my holy god. If I do it, if I see that example sounds silly, right? But, you know, it's not silly when Islam does it. It's not when they um, draw the prophet Muhammad, the one and only true <laughs> messenger of God. How dare you? But um, just switch the words, you know, Allah and the Prophet Muhammad with Zeus and um, Poseidon. There's really a difference there. Um, I don't see it. Just uh, different beliefs that people have. Again, uh, you could worship whoever you'd like, man. You could worship a gizmo duck or gizmo from uh, the gremlins. So it's your thing. Go ahead. Do what you want. But the moment that someone gets beheaded, uh, suicide bombers are uh, inspired to commit violence, that's when uh, it becomes lethal and wrong.
So just uh, laying my thoughts out there. You know, it could be right, it could be wrong, but I think it's important to have these discussions. I don't give a shit you know, what your job, job is. I'm gonna fuck if you're a garbage man, plumber, or a burger flipper. It's important to discuss these things peacefully, uh, tactfully, so we could all grow as a species.